Hey you guys, Xtool has come out with a new laser. This is the Xtool S1. Now I had this laser now for a few weeks and it's been so hard to keep the secret, especially since I've made so many projects and I posted photos of it on Facebook, Instagram, Reddit. And so many of you guys ask, which laser did you use? And I couldn't tell you that because the laser was not yet announced. So today I'm here to give you more information about this laser, talk a little bit about it, show you some projects that I made with this laser, and um you know see what this laser is about now where my agreement x tool i'm not allowed to show you the machine yet so that's why i'm showing you the box but i will tell you about it and i'll show you the things i've made with and we'll talk about what i like about this machine so what can i tell you about the x tool s1 well it is a 40 watt diode laser it's the first ever 40 watt diode laser to be fully enclosed this diode laser has more safety than any other laser out there. Uh, it has tons of fire detecting sensors and all that, but a lot of other lasers have that. What it does have that I love about it is the fact that it's uh, safe to the eye, so you do not have to wear goggles when you use it. So that's a huge, huge thing. Also because this fully enclosed, that means there will be no more smoke and fumes and stuff in my shop. My shop finally does not smell like a camp campfire. And uh, those smoke and fumes are not good for your health. So having it fully enclosed, that really, really helps. And actually, I don't even smell anything in my shop. I've been using it every day and there is not a bit of fume or smoke. Everything gets vented outside. So I love that about it. Like I said, you do not have to wear goggles or safety glasses with it. So that's another plus. Uh, it is super fast. It does superb engraving. And let me show you a couple of things that I did. Well, first of all, when you think of laser work, you're probably thinking of little trinket boxes like this that you make with a two millimeter plywood. I don't make this kind of stuff. <laughs> I, uh, I don't make this kind of stuff. The things that I like to do, I like to work with hardwood. I like to make, you know, real things. So this is a box that I made with this laser. And I wanna show you this inlay. I'm gonna come closer. This inlay was done with this laser, beautiful, beautiful. And um, it is so, so easy to do with a powerful laser like that. Also with this laser, I made this box joints. Like I cut this, all the pieces uh, for this box, I cut it with the machine. And look at the box joints, they're perfect, they're beautiful. You could never tell that the box like this was made with a laser. So those are the kind of things that I do. When it comes to engraving, it, that's beautiful engraving. I made this box. This is made with aromatic cedar. And look at that engraving. I mean, this is just beautiful. So much detail. Um, the light in the shop is not so great, but I mean, look at that. Engraving like this, I have not seen any machine do that. I also made this box over here with the same laser. And this engraving is done on maple. The box is walnut, but I cut all the pieces with the laser and I did this engraving. Look at the detail. You would think that 40 watt has a bigger laser um, spot and you wouldn't get so much detail, but look at the detail it is on this engraving. The same engraving I did on this box, I made it on this box as well. This is a square one. And the same thing, just beautiful, beautiful engraving done all with that laser. Now I do a lot of inlays and you can do boxes like this with beautiful inlays and a laser really makes it so, so easy. With this laser, I made an inlay for this box over here. I did this just two days ago and look at how clean that is. I love doing inlays with the laser. Cool. This is uh, the same tulip, let's see, the same engraving that I have on this box over here that is on the aromatic cedar. I did the same tulip with the same settings on walnut. And look at that. It looks like it's carved. It's, it's dark, but it's beautiful. It's just, it just has dimension. Like it doesn't look like it's laser engraved. The same thing with this one. Completely different. This one is more bam on your face. This one is sudden, but I love it. I wish you could see it in real life. Really, really nice. Does an excellent job. 
I have another engraving here. This one it was supposed to be a lid of a box, but when I cut it to make it the lid, I cut it too short. And um, well, now it doesn't fit, so it's kind of scrap wood. But look at that engraving. I mean, that is fantastic. So those are a couple of things that I did. This is another one of those Nightmare Before Christmas. But uh, here's a couple of things that I did with this laser. But let me tell you more about the functions of this laser. Why do I love it? And this laser has earned a permanent uh, spot in my shop, even though I'm limited in space and I really don't have space for any more machines. But I was uh, set on putting a laser here permanently because I use it all the time. And this laser is the one I chose for it. Now, let me tell you a couple of things about this laser. Uh, one of them is that it has a completely automatic focusing system, something I've never seen before. You know how in a normal diode laser, you have to unscrew the module and lower it. Then you have like a little setup block and screw it back on and so on. Well, this one, it's so much easier. What you do, you just pull the laser module over your wood piece, and then you push a button on your computer and automatically it takes focus. That's it, so easy. Another really cool thing about this laser that I've never seen on any other laser is the fact that it can engrave on a curved surface. The way this works is you take the laser module and you put it on a top left corner, kind of where your material is, and then you move it to the uh, right bottom corner and you tell the machine to create this depth map. And what it does, it just moves the laser in small increments, left and right, up and down within that surface that you chose. And it takes a um, measurement, the distance between the subject, the, your wood material, and the laser head. And it creates this depth map. And now it knows exactly what the distance is. And it can engrave on curved surfaces like wooden spoons, plates, and so on. That is really, really cool to see it in action. I cannot wait for you to see how that works. Um, one of my favorite things about this laser is the fact, um, the framing, the framing is different. It has a two point framing and that means, uh, cause I can't show you the machine. I'm going to try to explain you. Let's say this is my work piece and I want to do this, um, inlay right here in the middle. The way you would do it, you will take your laser module and you move it to this corner. So your X, um, laser, um, beam will be right here in the corner. Then you take the laser beam and you put it right here on this corner. So now the computer will know this is how big your material is from here to here. And then on the computer, on the screen, and to the X tool creative space, you will see this square. It will show you exactly the material, even though it doesn't have a camera, it produces it based on those two points that you set. And now you can see this exact square of the material onto your computer screen. So then you can take the design and position it however you want it. And you can get so accurate. Like if I want to get within a half a millimeter from the edge of the wood, I can do that. I can position it that close and get perfect, perfect, really accurate engraving. And I really love that. I didn't think I would like it, but it works really, really well. Now the machine is going to be fully released in the evening of October 18. That's when I will have the video, like I said, my full review on it. And um, if you want to check out the teaser from Xtool, check out the link below. Click on that so you can see what the machine looks like. And uh, I have no idea how much it will sell for. They did not tell me what the price is going to be. But whatever it is, I think it's going to be worth it because there is nothing like this out there. Super, super powerful. Tons of power. Beautiful engraving. You can cut pretty much any material. And... Um, I'm just excited. I cannot wait to show you more projects and work together on this and see what we can create with this machine. Now, if you don't want to miss my full review video, please make sure you turn that bell notification. So on the 18th in the evening, you will not miss my full review. I hope this was helpful to you and you learned something new. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Kyla Ewing and I'll see you in my next video.